happen. Right now, investigators in Tippecanoe County are trying to figure out how a little four year old boy died there. Tonight, we know they are calling his death a homicide. So today, our Rich Nye went to the boy's home in Lafayette looking for answers. Four year old Keandre Jolly died this week from injuries suffered last Friday at a home in Lafayette. The Tippecanoe County coroner now says the child's death was a homicide. Police came to this home on North 13th Street late Friday afternoon for an unresponsive child. The four year old was first taken to Franciscan Hospital in Lafayette, then flown to Riley Children's Hospital in Indianapolis for more specialized care. Jolly died Tuesday morning. Authorities have not released any information about Jolly's injuries or medical issues. The Tippecanoe County Coroner's Office performed an autopsy Wednesday. The preliminary results ruled the manner of death a homicide, but the cause of death is pending further investigation. Police say they found marijuana in the home, which led to the arrest of 33-year-old Montrell Jolly for a probation violation of a meth possession conviction last year. That man is a relative of the boy, but not his father. Lafayette police have not arrested anyone or named a suspect in the child's death. A woman at the house who told me she was Keandre's mother did not want to comment Thursday. In Lafayette, Rich Nye, 13 News.